Good evening. We just stepped foot into Epcot. Work is over for the weekend. And the sun is still out. Yeah. Not for too much longer. The DVC lounge is not open. Um, but we had some car issues today. Yeah. Our, um, our tires are just done. We've been in dire need of new tires for like six months now. Yeah, we've like been the past talking two, about it for a while. Like the past two drives to Chicago, we probably, it wasn't smart and or safe to do on those tires. But we're getting new ones tomorrow morning. Yeah, but we just need like a, one last jupe of air because yeah. one was losing air, but then all of a sudden a different one was basically was like flat. flat. So I was like, well, it's a good thing we're getting new tires tomorrow because I don't know why that's doing what it was doing. But hey, look. Be happy, oh, right? Here. Festival of the Arts, super happy. We're gonna sing all right. We have not done this in so long. Okay, Dustin. <laughs> I just. We both tonight were just like talking about what fast rides, what rides, what we wanted Epcot to look like tonight. And Sarah's like, I kind of feel fast. And I was like, yes. Side note, I walked back, back there every single day. Oh my god, look at that's the restaurant. How oh, have we not seen the Oh yeah, the, the space. Can we go restaurant. there after the single ride? Yeah. I used to walk past every day for work. Safety. Remain seated with your seatbelt fastened and your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the vehicle at all times. Here comes the final test. like stop in here and look at cars and you think cars are actually bought we here? did once i don't think they're bought here but we did once because they had like the suv all electric here once i think it's it's here still so if you are newer to the channel i don't, I don't we don't talk about it a whole lot hmm. but i did my couch program here in epcot yeah. future world electric umbrella quick service made the best french fries if you came in fall 2011 and had chicken nuggets or french fries good chance i made them and they were probably some really delicious. I had it down to a mathematical I don't even science. Think I ever had them when you made them. I like. I made the best of it. So like my my boss like kept me there all day every day for like twelve hour shifts. Too good. And because of it, like I like made a mathematical equation like of how often I should be dropping French fries. I tried my hardest, but this is just to the left of test track, and that's where like you come in to work. No matter where you work in. Epcot, I believe. Like, if you're a normal hourly pass member. But that next to it, you can see it when you're on test track. That's going to be the restaurant. And look, at there's glass. There is glass in there. And then there's that cool big outside. It's a space-themed restaurant, okay? We're going to the club, club cool. On Friday. Club cool. Where do you go on Friday night at the party? Club. Club cool. And also, I was literally getting thirsty the longer that we were in this park without coming here first. Like, I think I've literally trained my body to know that when I walk in this park, you're about to get Beverly or some kind of carbonated Fresh. beverage. There's getting his Instagram posts up, being super rude about it. It's so rude. It's so delicious. I've never seen these cutie pies before. They're by Gabby Zapata. Are you so excited to be back at the festival? I like always forget about the um the little booth. Wanna hear something silly? Yeah. I miss it already and it's not even gone. <laughs> monorail, monorail, I actually had the camera out to get. Usually like I wish somebody was filming us film. Right, that would be the best like blooper reel of all time. And that's the best way to be welcomed into World Showcase. Uh, yeah. Outside of leaving your room at the, the, one of the Crescent Lake hotels and then walking over, this is the best. We decided to just lean on this garbage can for a little while. But I don't, look know, at the I don't view. know if Sarah wanted to just enjoy the view or if Sarah was just like hurting for a break. <laughs> did, um, we tell our peoples that I went on a run this morning. I did a four mile run. It was hotter today. Mm -hmm. But I did. 
we were on the lookout for Little Brother because we've been kind of failing at finding the cute little artsy characters. Year of the Pig! In the pavilions. <laughs> and uh, Sarah pointed out that the, there's not much surface space in China to figure out where... Oh, there's stickers there. That's super cute. We came into the House of Good Fortune and I love to check out these teas. You I'm, like this tea, I've been right? like switching. I am a fan of oolong, but I do like jasmine as well. But please put a comment down below what some teas I should try. Have you noticed I've been drinking more tea? Mm -hmm. I have like a, a reusable steeper and all that good stuff. And the Earl Grey from our friends from Newcastle mm -hmm. has been delicious. It's like a German acapella group. Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, for our last song already, we would like to take all of you to a journey through Germany. <clears throat> la 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 da. Oh, ich hab solche Sehnsucht. Ich verliere den Verstand. Get ready for Bavaria, Bayern. Der Sommer mir. Jawohl. Bayern und das bayerische Bier. Jawohl! Bayern, jawohl, die Sommer mir! Bravo! Mir, das Sommer, mir, das Sommer, mir! Bayern! Das Sommer, mir! Bayern! 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 Ladies and gentlemen, this is Ben Affleck. Yeah. Right? He's with us. Thank you very much. We will come down now to take some pictures with you if you like. Otherwise, of course, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. We are Delta Q, and we say goodbye and yaoi. Uh, Sarah. Uh, what? Have I said Festival Arts is my favorite? You have. Because if I haven't, Festival Arts is. My favorite. We're merging. We're merging. We're merging. We're cutting left. That was awesome. We'll have to find their YouTube and put their stuff there. Because they were awesome. Yeah. What, like, professional, like, performance. Entertainers. I, Sugar Boo, if you're listening and watching, we would love to become owners of your company. <laughs> we came into Mitsukashi. One of our favorite stores that we don't go in enough. These are strawberries. Have you ever had strawberry? I think so. Sarah's grown up getting these that we call them koala yummies. I feel like They're, they used to be koalas. We always go for the chocolate filled ones. So if you come here and you've never had them, please know that this is a Brookhart Project stamp of approval. You must get these. I think it's like a the buck chocolate. or two for the individual pack. So we're in still in the shop and I wanted to show this cute dinosaur. I love it. I love all these little trinkets. What people don't realize is that little Peter, like seven I to get something I like. Seven to twelve year old Peter is all about this kind of stuff. Gundam, Dragon Ball, Pokemon, anime. Is Dragon Ball short for Dragon Ball Z? Well, it was a different series. It was a Dragon Ball Z series, it's Dragon Ball series, Dragon Ball GT. Look at this cuticans. I just love little trinkets. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, we could launch that. Eve would love that. She for her birthday? This. For Eve's birthday? Sarah so spotted a, a little friend of ours. I'm worried about this is up Riding just for uh, just for Festival Arts. Yeah. It's like the scavenger hunt. Uh, I want but, I want this frame but not with figment in the art. Um just in case you're gonna come and do it, I guess the prize is a coloring book. Not a so pin, like, but it has pin, been so passed. Like, yeah, I feel like like the worst. Shout out to gem sessions. To gem sessions, right? Yeah. Yeah. Emily was uh. Yeah, she was like, it was a coloring book. Yeah, she was looking for that pen. Yeah. I told you there's koalas. I don't know where our koala yummy came from, I think but you girls when you were they were you guys were little just called them yummies maybe. I, it wouldn't surprise me. Yeah. But that comes in strawberry and chocolate. I don't know. It looks like they're the exact same thing as the panda, the hello pandas, and we bought the hello pandas in Chicago, like at Pete's and stuff. Yeah. So either the qual yummies or the pandas, we don't discriminate against these animals. 
Tonight is just the night of exploring our pavilions we don't usually go in. Hidden Mickey. Oh, this is a cool salt and pepper puncher. Ooh. Abu. All this for a loaf of bread? Um, it looks like he's trying to steal more than a loaf of bread. Who knows what's in it? One of my favorite parts about Morocco is you literally can be right here looking around. And it looks like you are no longer in Epcot, but you are actually in Morocco. Just a humble monorail shot. They have like a deep dish pizza slice. One of the most hey. underrated quick services. I would like oh, take it a step further. The most underrated. Sunshine Seasons. We got a fast pants. Pants, pants. For Soren. Peter didn't even know it was his little surprise. Surprise me for my birthday. It's not my birthday. Sarah said, get the shot, so I got the shot. Did you appreciate the shot? Here's the shot. My God, the line is looking real good. Look at that. Fast pass right to the front of Fast Pass. Please take a seat and store all carry-on items in the underseat compartment. This includes cameras, purses, hats, and of course, these little yeah. beauties. <laughs> So the last like six or seven or eight times we've been on that, we've been like from one all the way, extreme from all the way to the left or all the way to the right. That we were closer to the center. It was such a good ride through. But I think, uh... Did you guys ever realize like this is supposed to look like the airport? No. It does look like an airport. What? <laughs> we were doing it a little easier tonight because we have an early day tomorrow and a very fun and busy weekend. Yeah, we want to edit tonight. Because tomorrow starts and early. Girl Scout cookies tonight. Oh, yeah. We got Girl Scout cookies. We even show those? No, but we already finished a lot of them. Oh, wait. We have like a whole trunk, a whole, the whole cruise here. We got oh, Chip, Dale, Pluto, Mickey. Bye. It literally feels blasphemous driving away. Peter Zinger to show him. A million dreams are keeping me. I'll give you a hint. Oh. The reason why we didn't stay is we didn't get home and get our stuff together because in the morning, we're dropping our car off to get new tires, new shoes, slippers, shoeses, and then we're going to Trails End Brunch for Joey Beth's birthday this week. You think just because you give them the hint that it's okay that we missed illumination? I'm trying to tell it to myself. Evie. What are you doing? We're trying to pick something to watch on Netflix. We were trying to watch like Studio Ghibli, but I don't think any of them are like streaming that we have. Eve's trying to get comfy for the movie. Sarah's about to put on this oxidizing mask. Oh, it's literally like a mask like that. It's not like a cream that you're smearing over yourself. No. Ooh, Eve is not gonna like this. <laughs> All right, we just finished the movie. Today is the eighth. Our friend's son turned seven today. What's the message? A true relationship is two unperfect people refusing to give up on each other. From Anonymous. Well, that was just beautiful. That quote was about that, um, that movie. Yeah. It actually <laughs> really Allied. was. Allied. We watched Allied. We watched the movie Allied from two years ago. And it was really good and nothing like we expected. And that's my favorite thing about a movie is when I can't guess what happens next. But it wasn't like the happiest of endings. You guys know me. If you've been watching for a little bit, I... I like very happy endings. It was a really good movie. I'm glad I watched it. Maybe you I'll, like I'll probably to watch it. my big brother George. Good idea, Ernie. A toast <laughs> to my big brother George, the richest man in town. <laughs> the 
the richest man in town. That's the kind of ending I like. <laughs> um, still had like a semi good ending, happy ending. So I'll probably watch it again. It was really good, really yeah. twists and turns and makes you think. Mm -hmm. But we have an early morning because we didn't add the, we were gonna edit the vlog tonight. We gotta edit the vlog tomorrow morning now because yeah, the big day. <laughs> Peter's been talking about it all day. He's like, I want to destroy the buffet. Trails end. Trails end. Yeah, I'm so, very excited. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.